With the Cardinals' fifth straight win over the 49ers, Arizona is now 5-0-1 in their last six games against the NFC West. Sunday's win marked the 43rd for Bruce Arians as head coach of the Cards, moving him into second place on the all-time franchise wins list behind Ken Wisenhunt. Since beginning play at University of Phoenix Stadium, the Cardinals are 8-2-1 in overtime home games. Arizona has never lost an overtime game under Arians, going 4-0-1. Sunday's game featured some strange anomalies. The first 27 points of the game came via field goals, as Arizona and San Francisco combined to tie the NFL record for most field goals in a game with nine. The Cardinals' only lead of the game came in the final minute of overtime. They were tied or trailing for 69 minutes and 28 seconds. The defense continues to be stout against the run, allowing the Niners just 95 yards rushing and San Fran's top back, Carlos Hyde, to 68 yards. The Cardinals have gone 17 consecutive games without allowing a 100-yard rusher, the longest active streak in the NFL. Leading the way for the defense was safety Tyron Matthew, who tallied a season-high 11 solo tackles, two for a loss, and a sack. Against his former team, safety Antoine Bethay recorded the 20th interception of his career. Receiver Jerron Brown established career highs in both receptions, eight, and receiving yards with 105. Quiet for most of the afternoon, Larry Fitzgerald saved his best for last. Fitzgerald became the first player in NFL history with an overtime touchdown reception in both the regular season and postseason. The game-winning touchdown Sunday was the 17th TD versus San Francisco, more than any other player in history against the Niners. Next up for Larry Legend and the Bird Gang, a trip to Philly to play the 3-1 Eagles. Fitz has been a thorn in the side to the city of brotherly love. In eight career games against the Eagles, including the NFC Championship in 2009, Fitzgerald has 50 receptions for 845 yards and an astounding 11 touchdowns.